Today I attempt to repo cars from the most dangerous serial killers. This is our riskiest repo yet and one mistake can be deadly. Let's get into it. First thing we have to do is check the bank list and see who is up for repo. And it looks like we have four pending people. All of them do have warning flags and they may be armed and dangerous. Okay guys, so we're gonna have to be careful tonight. Uh, we're gonna head out and see if I can locate all four of these vehicles. They are paying really well, so if we can find them, we're gonna make a ton of money. They're paying $5,000 for each one, which is way more than normal, so I guess it's because they have the warning flags, but $5,000 times 420K, that's a lot of money. We can make all of that tonight that would be great so the first location is up in the county so let's hop onto the highway and head up there all right guys we are heading up into the mountains and head into a remote area uh, actually like a abandoned lake community up here in the mountains and we're looking for a guy named jason Voorhees, which is a little suspicious because that's the name of the guy from friday the 13th obviously but um I kind of feel like somebody's playing a prank on me because it is Halloween, but I don't know. We're getting paid for this, so let's head out here and see if we can locate the vehicle that we have to repossess. Now, like I was saying, this area is an old abandoned neighborhood. I don't think anybody really lives out here, but let's see. I think I can go down here. This place looks pretty deserted. I do see a car over there. I think that may be it. I have to make sure we can get across this water. So we're just going to full send this. There we go. All right, let's keep our eyes open. A lot of mobile homes out here. I don't see any people. I'm pretty sure that's the vehicle we're looking for, so I'm gonna just try to back up to it, hook it, and get out of here. All right, let's make this quick. Put the bed down. Who the heck is that? Oh, that's not who I think it is. Hello? Alright, my eyesight is bad, guys. I have to do this. Oh, he got an axe. Yeah. Something's up with that guy. Alright, let's get this car and get out of here. So one of this much. Go ahead. I got a weird gentleman. He's making me feel a little uncomfortable out here near 401. He does have like an axe in his hand. And he's staring at me. 10-4, I'm in the area. I'll come by. 10-4. Hey, man, is is this your car? I have a, a repo order for it. I'm, I'm going to take it, okay? You just you just stay over there, and I'll, I'll stay over here. Wait a minute. Where did he go? Where the heck did he go? Okay, I have no idea where the guy just went. I'm going to wait until the police gets here. And I guess I'll just show them the repo order and then I'll just get out of here. But I don't see anybody else in the area. I don't understand what's going on. All right, looks like the police are here. I have no idea where that guy went, though. It's kind of freaking me out a little bit. Hey, boss, man. Hey, deputy. So, um, sorry to call you all the ways out here. I, um... I was doing a repo on this car here. I got the paperwork for it. I don't know if it's the owner or... I don't know. It's just a weird guy. He was over there in the bushes and he had like a axe in his hand. I mean, maybe he was trying to cut the tree or something. But I don't know. It's not many people out here. And the way he was staring at me, I, I just felt a little intimidated. Which bush was it? Uh, he, he was over here somewhere. Alright. I'll just... Canvas the area, and if I find anything, I'll let you know. Okay, be, be careful, because he may be armed. Yeah, I don't 
I'm, I don't think it was anything, but I'm just gonna watch his back just in case. I mean, there's definitely somebody in those bushes. You guys saw him too, right? I'm not bugging out. I mean, we honestly, the smart thing to do here would be to just take the car and leave, but I kind of want to get to the bottom of this now. Like, I feel like I'm invested in the mystery here and I, I want to solve it. Hey, boss man, um, I'm not seeing nothing. Um, there's behind the buildings and everything. I already scared him off. So oh, okay. if, he's, if he comes back or anything, I'll be in the area, so don't hesitate, call. Okay, appreciate uh, it. I gotta run to this other call. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get out of here right behind you because this place is a little creepy. <laughs> All right. All right, thanks for coming out. Catch you later. Yep. All right, uh, let's see if we get the winch on. Uh, dang, something's wrong with my winch. Hold up. Uh, let me see if I can fix my winch. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on here. This thing is acting up. It was working earlier when we used it. All right, this is like the worst time for my winch to be acting up. We got to make sure we continue to watch ourselves here. All right, I think I got it. Perfect. All right, got it, got it, got it. We're going to get the winch attached to the vehicle. And now we can start winching it up. Oh, guy's back. Hey, man. I'm gonna call the police again if you keep acting weird like that. Hey, hey, you, you gotta step back with that with that weapon. You can't be getting close to me with that. Oh, oh, shit, he's chasing me. And he's swinging it. What the heck is that? Is this some type of sick prank? Is this a joke or something, man? What's What's going on? Oh, oh, this is real. Ouch. That hurts. Okay, we got to get out of here, guys. I don't know what's going on. Uh, to, to, to one to dispatch. Ah. Go ahead. I, I just got hit. I got struck by an axe. <laughs> this guy, this guy's out here. 401. I need help. And is anybody else out here? All right. I just got to get back to the truck and try to get out of here. We got to go. Luckily, this thing is already on. Let's get out of here. Okay, I'm inside. I wonder if this is his car. Boy, he seems a little mad. Back up, man. Back up. Oh, he just hit my truck. Get out of here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no, he's getting closer. I need help. Somebody help. Uh oh, he's on the back of the truck. He's he's trying to break in through the glass. Help! Somebody help! Wait, I hear somebody. He's trying to get away. Who the heck is that? It's me, it's Jack. Jack, I'm so happy to see you, man. I'm stuck, and I, this Jason guy's trying to kill me. Yeah, I overheard on the radio you need a little bit of help, so I figured I'd stop by and see if I could give you a hand. Man, I've never been this happy to see you or a Mosley truck before. <laughs> well, here I am. Be right. able to please. I don't believe it. Get me out of here before that guy shows back up. Oh, my God, the water's getting higher. Come on, Jack, come on. Jack, thank you. I think I'm good from here. All right, 
Any signs of that guy? I don't see him. Alright, let's get out of here, man. I'm gonna let the cops deal with that guy. Or whatever's left of them. I don't know, that was very weird, guys, but, yo, Jack saved the day. I would have probably died out there because he was busting our windows and it was crazy. Alright guys, we made it to the city and I'm so happy that, you know, Jack came down and rescued me because that was about to be crazy. But anyway, if we're going to continue and repo in the rest of the vehicles tonight, we're going to need some type of weapon. So we're here at the ammunition store and I can't really buy a gun because I'm not a licensed gun holder, but I'm going to see if they have anything else that I could use to just keep me safe tonight. Alright, let's see. What do they have in here? So yeah, a gun would be nice, but like I was saying, I don't have a permit for that. So we're going to have to choose from something that won't get us in trouble, but would still keep us safe. So I'm thinking a bat would be good for that. All right, let's try it out. Yeah, that should work good. All right, let's head back to the truck. What the hell? Lady, are you okay? What happened to her? All right, something strange is going on. Hey. Hey, hey, man. Get, stay over there. You stay over there. Stay right there. Oh my god. I don't know if this bat is gonna work against the hatchet. Hey, hey, stay over there, man. Oh shit. Get, get down. Get, oh god. Oh, goodness. Hey, hey. Oh. Come down from there. <laughs> okay, we got him. We got him. Oh, I lost the tire. Oh, no. Okay. I got to try to get back to the shop. How did he even get here? The place we repoed the car from is like two miles away from here. How did he get here so fast? Okay. I got to get out of here. I got to call for help for that lady, and I got to get to the shop. All right, guys, I was able to get this thing to the shop. Now, normally I wouldn't drive like this, but because of what's going on tonight, I just want to get out of here. So um, let's park this thing inside. We're going to have to try to repair it. It's going to have a lot of damage from all the sparks and stuff. But let's get this inside. I'll grab another truck, and then we'll try to repo the next vehicle. All right, guys, we are now in Mirror Park getting ready to look for vehicle number two. Apparently, this one is registered to a guy named Freddy. So let's see if it goes better than the one with Jason. I'm a little worried. I'm hoping Jason doesn't pop up again on us. But I see the car. There it is, guys. Now, this is actually a 1958 vehicle, but um, somehow it's up for repo. So we're going to repo it. All right, let's quickly approach. I see somebody in the window, though. Who is that? What the heck is that? That's not Freddy, is it? You stay there, and I'll stay over here, and we'll be okay. Uh, let me winch this vehicle up. What the heck? How do, how do you get up there? Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, I'm calling for help. I'm calling for help. Uh, I got to get it up. Oh, 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 oh. Run. Oh, shit. Oh shit. Hello, help, help. My radio. Hello, help. What's going on with my radio? Oh, ow, 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 ouch, ouch, ouch. Okay, my radio is not working, guys. I gotta get out of here. I don't even have time to get the, get the, uh, my bat. Oh. Okay, maybe I gotta fight. Ouch. Leave me alone pay your bills and I won't have to do this oh god I'm dead come on one good hit one good hit oh ouch this bat is not working guys he's dodging everything I, I'm gonna just try to get out of here where is he where is he okay he's going up there I'm going this way hit that Oh, no, 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 I miss, I miss, I miss. Get in, get in, get in, please get in the car. <laughs> okay, okay, 
Okay, we gotta just get into the driver's seat. Lock the door. Okay, we got it. He's mad, but we got it. I need to go to the hospital, guys. I done got hit with a hatchet. I got stabbed by some giant nails. I, I don't even know how I'm alive right now. This is crazy. At least the truck is in good condition and the car is good. So somehow my radio is not working. It's like it's dead or something. I don't know. Let me let me try my phone. See if that works. Damn, my phone's dead too. Now before we do the next repo, I'm gonna stop and grab some better equipment from this ammunition. And we're gonna make sure we're better prepared to deal with what we have to deal with. I bought a bulletproof vest, I bought a helmet, and I bought something that I'm gonna keep a secret, but I have it just in case I have to use it. All right, so let's get to the next repo. So we're now up here in the forest looking for vehicle number three, and it's gonna be a older vehicle again. We're looking for a Silverado. And I think that's it right there, yep, light blue. Let's try to make this one quick. I'm not even gonna put on my lights because I don't want any extra attention. Let's just hop out, put the bed down. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Latch to that. And let's winch this thing up. What the heck? Oh no, come on. Come on, come up, come up, come up. I don't have time, Silverado. Get on. Get on here. Get on. Get, get on. Get on. Get on. Okay. We got it. Let me hit the button. I'm not fooling around with this guy. I got stabbed too much. Leave, leave me alone, man. Hey, leave the truck alone. This is my third truck I'm on for tonight. Hey, hey. Oh. Should I fight him back? He got a chainsaw. I don't know if this is a good idea. Hey. I think the hatchet. Hey, hey. Oh. Oh, no, no, no. That's enough for me. That's enough for me. I'm not a hero. I am not a hero. Hey. Get down from there. All right, we got to figure out a way to get out of here, guys. Actually, can I just go this? Oh, yeah, we're good. We're good. You should have paid your bill on your 86 truck, man. Sorry, it's nothing personal. Also, you, you shouldn't run around with sharp objects. It's dangerous. All right, that's enough of that, guys. Let's get out of here. We got a long way back to the city. And we'll drop this thing off. All right, guys. So we're now looking for vehicle number four, which is by a guy that goes by the name of Michael Myers. And as we could already expect, we already know who it's going to be, guys. But we got to try to get this station wagon from him. It's another older vehicle. I believe it's gray. And let's see if we can find it. Now, of course, it's going to be out here in the middle of nowhere where nobody is. So we got to be very careful this time around, guys. Very, very careful. But I think if he comes out, I have that surprise for him, and I think we'll be okay. Uh, I'm thinking we just go in with no lights again, guys. I don't want any attention at all. Okay, we're here. There's lights on inside, which means somebody is probably home. I see a vehicle over here. But that is not a station wagon, so that's not what we're looking for. Maybe he's not home? I don't know. I know a lot of times people like to try to hide. Oh my god, it's so loud. A lot of times people like to hide the vehicle, so let me check around back and see if I find it. This truck is so loud. If anybody's in there, they're pretty much going to know I'm here by now. It makes no sense I turn off the lights, to be honest. go guys I think that's it pretty sure that's it all right let's back up to it and let's attach it again no lights no extra attention too far gotta back up more did 
that should be good. Yeah, let's make this quick. Drop the bed. Grab the winch. Okay, the winch is attached. Get on, please get on, please get on. Hey, hey, I know who you are. I got a gun, you stay, you stay back. Yeah. Oh, okay, good, good, that, that bought me some time. All right, uh, I gotta get his car on here somehow. Come on, come on, come on. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Disconnect that. Attach that. Oh my god, he's coming! And I don't know what's going on with that. It took him out, though. Oh, oh! Ouch! Oh no! Oh no! We don't have the car, guys. We need the car. We need the car. Uh oh. Leave the truck alone, man. Come on. All right, I got an idea, guys. I got it. I got to do this. All right, we shot through the window. That may have bought us a little bit of time, but I got to get this bed up. Thing keeps falling off the bed. It's the worst time for this to be happening. All right, attach, winch up. Oh my god, oh, he's over there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, attach. Is it loaded? Okay, it's loaded. Put that up. Come on, go up. Smoke is killing me. We gotta get out of here. All right, let's get out of here. I don't even have the thing all the way up, but that's fine. We're gonna have to just drive like that. Oh, he's up. He's up. Hey, move out the way. We kind of hit him with the side. Let's go. I barely have the station wagon secured. I got doors open on the side, but I don't even care because ugh, this is vehicle number four and that's all that matters. Let's get out of here. All right, guys, we made it back to the shop and I got vehicle number four. That means we're gonna get paid and that's why we are the best guys. Nobody wanted to touch this contract because of the how dangerous these four people are and we got the job done guys so all i gotta do is park this thing inside take pictures of everything and then we are good to go so i believe we are up to bay number six now so let's get this inside get the door open it's a little tricky i gotta be close enough so it opens but not too close that we hit it. I think we got it. All right, so let's get inside. And we'll park that up right there. Do have to get that other truck fixed, but we'll take care of that later. All right, put the bed down. What the hell? Uh, Freddy's back, guys. We have a little bit of a problem. Hey. Uh, e damn it. Right, let's just get out of here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I don't know what to do. I'm running. I'm running. Oh, 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 no. Not that way. Not that way. Uh, I need to get to the car. I got a gun in the car. I got to get to the car. I got to get to the car. I got to get to the car. Oh, oh, ah, ah. ouch, 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 ouch. Ah, ah. Run. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, we got to get out of here. Forget the gun. We're not about that life. Uh, we gotta get out of here. We gotta go. We gotta run. We gotta run. Oh. Hey. Come on, man. 
Come on, guys. Don't do this to me, please. I'll give you guys your cards back. I Guys, I am dead bleeding out here. No, I set the shot on fire. Oh my god, we're gonna lose so much money. And they got their cars. <laughs> Wait a minute, my alarm clock is going off? That means I'm alive, I'm not dead. Well, I'm happy to be alive. I'm happy that was all just a dream. I guess it's time for me to get to work now. Oh my God. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Here is a quick blooper of the video as well for you guys. And also make sure you click here to watch the next video where we got into some more crazy repos with our tow company. Click here to watch and I'll see you over there. <laughs> Let me <laughs> Oh my God.